back to the Crochet Cloud. So with my friends at Yarnspirations.com. I'm your host, Mikey. Today we're going with Jonah's Crochet Collective Motifs. This is motif number seven of the fan panels. If you would like to use this stitch for something else and make it bigger, it's a multiples of 10 plus nine. So just go 10, 10, 10. When you're happy with the width of it, just add nine more and you'll have the proper balance for this particular one. You'll notice in this particular motif, there's only two sets of fans for the size that we're doing. And that's what we're going to begin. Use your five millimeter size H crochet hook, and you'll need to make a total of four of them for the blanket. So please either chain 29 if you're doing the motif, anything else it's 10 plus nine. So 10, 10, 10, add nine at the end. So one, two, three, four, five, go all the way to 29 and meet me back here in just a moment. Let's begin our first row and you are going to go uh, four chain from the hook. So one, two, three, go to the fourth, just turn it around and get the back hump of it and you're going to double crochet. So you do that one plus then four more. So just keep on moving. So the chains that you skipped is considered one. This is considered uh, a total of two. So there's a total of three so far. And you're doing this right to the point that you can count a total number of six. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so there's a total of five double crochets in this chain three. It's considered one as well, so it's a total count of six. You're then going to skip two and double crochet twice into the third one away. So we have one and two, chain two, and then two more double crochets into the same stitch. So you'll skip two, and now you're only gonna crochet five in a row. So double crochet five. So one, two, three, four, and five. And that will be your repeat pattern going across. So to do the next fan, you'll skip two, go to the third, and put in two double crochet, chain two and two double crochet. So you'll skip two. And if this is going to another fan, so then you would put in five double crochets and then skip two and then do your fan and then skip two and so on. But in this case, because we're finishing up after you've skipped the next two, you're just going to double crochet the final six that you have. And that'll happen even if it's the long version, if you're doing a, a multiple of something else. Okay, so you have a total of six double crochets on the edging. Just like that. So you turn your work and we're gonna begin row number two, which will be the repeat until your project is a total of eight inches tall. To start again, you are going to chain three and starting in the next one, you'll apply one double crochet in each of the double crochets. So there's a total of five of them. So with the chain three plus these five, that gives you the number six. Okay, do you see that? So one, two, three, four, five, six. In the fan work itself, you'll do the following. So right in the chain two, apply two double crochet chain two and two double crochet. And so you're just gonna immediately go to your, see the group of five double crochets there? That's where you're gonna go. So skip over the fan work and just do one double crochet in each of the five. So one, two, three, four, and five. So if it's a multiple of something else that you decided to do, the fives will always be separating in between these fans. So once you get the five, go right to your next fan, apply two double crochet, chain two and two double crochet. And then you're gonna come to the very ending and there will be six a total. 
and you're just going to apply one double crochet in each of the final six. The last one is a turning chain, so do not forget that. Most new crocheters forget that or they don't see it because of their tension. So make sure that the last one, this is not the last one, people think it is, but it's actually here. And don't go into a space, go right into the top of the turning chain. Okay, so you have a total count of six again. So you're gonna turn your work and you're just going to keep on going until your project is a total of eight inches tall and then you're gonna fasten off and then do the border and you only need to do four of these for motif number seven. That's it for today. We hope you have a good one.